that's nice of you. All right, hello everyone, it's me. And yes, I did say I'd do the next video will be a Swedish news video, and I sort of sidetracked myself slightly. Let's go the older bloody uh, beacons. Uh, so yeah, I looked at the update. It was cool, you know, quite interesting. I got to play around with some bits, some bobs, sods and sods, and yeah. Uh, apparently, I've turned off all the bloody spawning signals because I was gonna make my own little map. So I thought, well. If the prototype is going to be the secret lab sort of style thing, we can make a little adventure map. And I thought, well, I've been making a couple but never finished any, so I thought I might as well give it a go. So we've got some Excel blood mocks on. There's a prototype mod which has been seen around, which has got some uh, more heavier prototype weapons. So my idea is is a simple, but quite stupid, idea that jump drives have been failing. They've been going off in shipyards. They've been uh, messed around with so it's kind of an idea of a uh, like oh what's going on we don't understand and I've babbled I put some bullshit into a data pad and sort of on about you know a good few thousand years jump drives have worked well but the right idea is we're gonna have a, a science division on a planet that no one really knew cared about you know it's one of them no one particularly cares but the idea is why is this all the way over here? That's quite right here. I can find it later. Don't work. But basically, because like I said, I keep getting these uh, body factorum. So let's quickly keep getting these body factorum mail. Let's leave all but a cargo container, save that. Remove you. But basically, what we're doing is quite simple. Ships have been jumping randomly. They've been sort of, you know, it's one of them. I might have an excuse for like a jump drive frequency or some nonsense. But. There'll be stuff like this on the planet from the new factions. And the idea is we got a set of five people, they've come out as a task force, might give them a rover, or might let them on foot. Or give them a ship or something, probably daft. Might be able to give them a, a ship because they came from this. So if we give them I can give them a ship, we can give them like a I have to make something, but we'll, we'll come up with something. And they've been going around trying the damnedest and they found one of these and they're quite surprised it makes no sense it's a space yard and it's on planet so my kind of idea is is to make a couple notes a couple like nods and uh, a few things about a place like why is this here these are space rated ships they're in the, in the shipyard designed for space give it two decades and this thing's gonna snap it off because how structurally it's not even connected correctly but it's one of them. We've got a ship landed over here. So this is what's meant to be the task force and the crew who have died because guess what? The ship landed quite softly with parachutes, but still it did some damage. And it's frozen inside. They've all died because all the fuses and such have gone off. They've lost power. They've pretty much exhausted themselves because they're on top of really tall melting. It's fucking cold. There's, there's also this. I can power station for the refinery because there's assembler on board the ship so that makes sense they've used the refinery they've got the assembly in mind one of the crews dead and buried his name is John so whoever's going to get an easter egg of burying picking up John they can do that but the idea is this task force have been sent and top secretly it's one of them the last reports of a jump drive failing because you know a jump drive physically can't enter, enter atmosphere it just stops you it doesn't let you go into atmosphere, it doesn't let you enter it, isn't it literally is hard coded to save you from that. So the, the idea is the last reported one is like, you know, two thousand years ago or two thousand two thousand five hundred years ago where I noted down, it's like, well you we're talking years upon years, jump drive failure now. Nah. You're talking generations of jump drives ago. 
and that's the idea. All surviving jump drives known to have this issue are either museums or literally rusted to point of collapsing in on themselves. There isn't physically evidence left of anything this old. But I did note down... Where is it? I need to make sure I'll just question myself my own writing. Uh, top secret. Level 9 clearance. Da, 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 da. Yes. It was all about, there's no physical copies, but a research division was looking into what I put into. That's one I have on me in mind. I need to put that into the other place. That's the shipyard I've got to put in there. Great. I need to put dating because you know this is meant to be really old, so we're going to go 3,000 years. Now we're going to do a thousand years ago. Now we're going to do a hundred years. So we're going to go there. Yeah, so that makes more sense. So we're looking at, well, there's this old talk of, well, someone's been looking into jump drives. It's been basically the prototype stuff is meant to be enough group. That's kind of been doing some sneaky stuff. And that's the idea. So you have a ship. It's got a little snub fighter. I was thinking another ship we can chuck on there. It's got a tower. So basically, this has got a task to. Well, there's a beacon here, which I need to put. Actually, while I'm over here, I need to put the pretty data pad in its crate. Well, this is like brand new. Like I said, it's barely been touched. Not even any dust on it, really. So the idea is. This, for some reason, is here. So we have ships randomly jumping from shipyards even, or from simple docked up. We're going to have this tower here, which is going to be really old, but seems like a basic communications tower, or relay or something. That's the idea. And the other ship you crashed is a warship, which is why... Well, it's like an unfinished warship, so the idea is this potentially is my light... Was it battle cruiser? So oddly enough, this ship is practically gutted. There's nothing left inside. It's. I might put things in, putting in uh, some reports of testing, but we've got a brand, new, basically a new ship, unpainted even, and it's chucked at the planet. And the and the lab. So yeah, I've got to build a lab. So pretty much, my idea is to have this place filled with some really old stuff, some really new stuff, and to have one. Fuck off lab somewhere. I'm gonna build something. I think I kinda wanna build a tower or something daft. But basically There's gonna be a great big project lab full of stuff and such, and it's gonna suggest teleportation, because you know jump drives are basically teleportation, I mean the mess with space and time. Somewhat. I mean they, they do distance things, so we can come up with an excuse, but yeah. The idea is that something's not quite right. And it's a bit of a daft one, I don't know if I finish it or it's just me going to build a little It's not going to be much of a story, it's just a little venture map of, oh look, here's some new stuff, oh look, here's some old stuff. Ooh, big scary lab. And it's going to suggest, potentially if I get it further along, because I've literally just started this today and put it together as a quick idea, teleportation because then we can go to other planets and we can go ooh the coordinates to this is on that planet so the idea is it's long term not too much I don't want to have this world covered in a bunch of crap but the idea is you're kind of hopping around trying to find the answer and you also get to use some of the prototype stuff which is neat maybe I don't know I could be just rambling so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed. It's just a quick sort of thing to show off. And yeah, I'm not really sure how much further I'll take it, but 
potentially I could even play for it if I had time. Probably don't, to be fair. Bit very busy. Today's like my off day, so I'm going to stream in a bit. Have some food first. And hopefully check the weather report. Is it going to rain? I don't know. I'm hoping it's not going to rain. Anyway, have a good day. That's all I've got to say. Like and subscribe and all that. And do comment down below any ideas of... I don't know. What, what I could do. I'll take them into consideration. But generally, like I said, I want to create sort of like a simple... Sort of, oh look, there's something over here. Oh look, there's something over there. I'm probably going to have a crate and a notepad on top of this, so someone's going to have to climb up all the way on this, or they could just cut it down and see what happens. <laughs> but yeah. I'm just going to create a bunch of nonsense. This could be the most... I'm not a story writer. I don't write. Well, I mean, you can see how I've had a that, so this is going to be an absolute shit box of a world, but you know. It would be interesting, and I made something for a bit of fun. So yeah. Have a good day, I don't know. I'm gonna, before I keep going on and stop rambling, I'll cut it off into the sunset while you all go blind. Wahaha. Right.